let's take a look at these uh, plastic balls with the uh, toys you get 10 of these for uh, 120 rupees or around uh, two dollars or so so let's take a look at uh, what we get we get this smaller tank with the uh, four wheels we get this ladybug with the uh, wheels we get this futuristic looking plane we get this racing uh, car there is even a chair inside but not steering though this looks like a spaceship you know really detailed We get this jeep, nice detailing on the inside, it even has a steering. It's a balloon with a blower. When the balloon deflates, it makes quite a lot of noise. A bird themed uh, vehicle. It's a monster themed vehicle. Nice touch with the handlebar. Some kind of a scorpion themed uh, vehicle. These are all the toys we get. I think this is the best designed one. Most detailed one. Quite nice. Check it out. Let's take a look at this Neil Gray's milkshakes. One is mango milkshake. The other one is a coffee caramel milk. They've been around since uh, 1905. Sterilized, uh, homogenized uh, mango flavored milkshake. Best before 90 days. That's the packaging date. Costs around uh, 30 rupees or uh, 50 cents. Manufactured in uh, Bengaluru, India. Ingredients are uh, milk, sugar, stabilizers, emulsifiers, and uh, artificial uh, mango flavoring substance. That's the nutritional info. Let's taste it. That's the color. Let's taste it really nice mango flavor and uh, not too sweet which makes the mango flavor uh, taste even good nice uh, mango smell too this is the coffee caramel milk costs around uh, 35 rupees or uh, 50 cents the ingredient lists are uh, milk sugar and uh, natural identical and uh, artificial uh, coffee flavoring that's the nutritional info
this has a really nice coffee flavor and uh, very tasty you can uh, taste that uh, caramel and uh, coffee it is. this is a uh, much more sweeter than uh, this even though both of them say sugar uh, at nine percent smells and uh, tastes really good quite nice check it out Let's take a look at this fair uh, neon gel pens. You get five uh, neon gels with really bright colors. It costs around uh, 50 rupees for this pack or uh, 80 cents or so. It's manufactured in uh, Daman, India. That's how the pen looks. So let's draw something with this. really bright colors as you can see and the pen also has a nice grip here it writes really smoothly and uh, really bright colors quite nice check it out let's take a look at this garden tea time puri That's how the snack looks. Those are the ingredients, only seven of them. It's manufactured by Calvin Kara Private Limited in uh, Mumbai, India. That's the nutritional info. It uh, costs around uh, 44 rupees or around uh, 80 cents or so. These are uh, made from uh, wheat flour and uh, spiced just right. Go ahead and uh, enjoy your uh, tea time with uh, this perfect partner. That's how it looks. Let's taste it. They are perfectly spiced, not too salty, not too spicy. This is a traditional uh, homemade snack. They have uh, reduced the size and uh, made it uh, smaller, which is uh, easier to eat. Quite nice. Check it out. Let's take a look at this don't share video. These are uh, some of the products I sent uh, one of my Patreon supporter. Few of these snacks to lollipops and uh, 
few chocolates and uh, two of these are uh, milk drink mixes one is a uh, almond mix one is a uh, ragi malt mix these are uh, very indian drinks thank you to all my patreon supporters if you want to receive a package like this support me on a uh, patreon quite nice check it out Let's take a look at this delicious chocolate chip cookies. These are uh, gourmet cookies. Chocolate chip uh, made with Ghana cocoa. It's by Sunfeast. That's a brand of uh, ITC. Really simple packaging and uh, quite a nice product shot. That's the ingredient list, nutritional info. They manufacture in uh, quite a few places in India. Vegetarian product. This costs around uh, 30 rupees or around uh, 50 cents or so. You get uh, six of these bags. Not a big fan of uh, individual wrapping. So let's taste it. Pretty much the exact size on the packaging. Let's taste it. really tasty cookie and the Ghana chocolate really adds to the flavor the chocolate is uh, really soft and uh, very flavorful quite nice check it out let's take a look at this razor candy machine that's how it looks it's made in China by Sunshine Fancy. That's how the machine looks. That's how the eraser dispensing machine looks. It costs around uh, 120 rupees or around uh, 2 dollars or so. You can say razors in uh, all shapes and sizes. You can also replace those with uh, some small candy. And to get to it, just uh, twist this. And the uh, eraser drops by. Because of the odd shapes of the erasers, some do get stuck. But a little bit of shaking uh, does the trick. Looks nice on a desk. 
to refill the erasers you can just remove it and that's how the mechanism looks as you can see some of them do get stuck I think they just repurpose the candy machine for our erasers. Still quite good though. Quite nice. Check it out. Let's take a look at this body chocolate. No idea why it's called body. This is from uh, Turkey. So I wanna try the Google Translate to see if there was any meaning uh, in Turkish. But uh, there is none. So I am as puzzled as uh, you are. That's how it looks. It's from uh, Turkey. Again, a lot of information. This costs around uh, 12 rupees or around uh, 15 cents or so. Let's taste the body. You get a chewy layer and a liquidy caramelly layer inside. Quite nice. Check it out. Let's take a look at these uh, stacker pencils. This set costs around uh, 60 rupees or around a dollar you get out four of these that's how it looks You get a pencil, and uh, each of these is a is a pencil. You only get about uh, this much uh, pencil leg, but the benefits of this are that uh, you don't have to sharpen once the lead finishes. You just uh, move it back. Even though there is uh, this much pencil left, you only use uh, this. Once that's done, you have to replace it because there is no way to push the pencil lead out. And you can uh, keep going. Yeah, each one of them is a small pencil yeah. this is good uh, if you want to carry a small pencil while traveling you can break a small piece of it and uh, take this with you rather than the whole thing you can also combine a couple of these to make a really long pencil Not a good pencil for a regular use, but for uh, emergencies where you need a sharp pencil 
and you don't have time to sharpen it this could come handy also as a traveling pencil it's quite useful you can break it to whatever size you want and you will always get a sharp tip quite nice check it out let's take a look at this nestle munch nuts that's how the packaging looks that's the munch delicious coated wafer peanut cream and uh, crunchy peanut bits eat half twist the wrapper and uh, store it has uh, two servings in the pack costs around uh, 20 rupees or around uh, 35 cents that's the ingredient list manufactured in uh, Himachal Pradesh in India nice comic uh, like explanation let's taste it That's how the bar looks. It's a one long piece covered in a peanuts. Let's taste it. That's how the insides look. You get a peanut cream inside between the wafers, and uh, on top you get a uh, peanut pieces. Even the wafers are uh, really thin. So it's like uh, eating a big peanut bar, very tasty and uh, quite peanutty. So it works just like the mentioned quite nice check it out let's take a look at this Bania hairspray this is a hairspray with the pro vitamin B5 long lasting hold with the pro vitamin B5 to nourish and protect your hair mega hold I haven't seen many hairsprays we have a lot of hair gels but uh, very few hairsprays even uh, this is uh, imported costs around uh, 90 rupees or around uh, 2 dollars for this it says uh, made in uh, EU this is the area I sprayed and you can see it holds quite well it smells really amazing quite nice check it out 